my name is Benjamin, the Deputy CEO for Thailand. I'm also the uh, Club Licensing Director for the FAA Thailand. Uh, every time I go to Vietnam with my wife or family, uh, I like to watch a willing match. So I think uh, Vietnam has uh, a lot of potential, skillful players and uh, I think also a strong league, which I think can be better if the league is more structured. So I think Vietnam has a lot of potential in the region as a footballing country. A few reasons why we have the ASEAN player in the Thai league. I think the first reason is uh, to raise the level of ASEAN players. So we want the ASEAN players to play in the best league in ASEAN, which is the Thai league. Uh, secondly, it's also for the Thai players to exchange some ideas and playing style with different ASEAN players. Thirdly, it's also the, uh, it's the commercial reasons. So different companies and businesses can come to Thailand when their players are playing in Thai League. And the last reason is also to promote Thai League to the fans regionally. So we have about 650 million fans in ASEAN, or people in ASEAN. So that will promote Thai League to the fans regionally. So I would like to have Vietnamese players to play in Thai League because I know there will be a lot of following from Vietnam fans to Thai League. And I, one, of the, one of the regret that I had is uh, I didn't manage to get Le Con Vinh to come to play because I personally like Le Con Vinh. I'm, I'm here. So I think players like Kong Phuong, I think he's good enough and definitely will create an impact in the Thai League. So I would like Vietnamese players to come and try themselves and test themselves in the Thai League.